Hi guys, this is Amanda Trader. I'm Senior Manager of Learning and Education for Explore Today, I'm going to show you guys how to make a really fun, simple bubble solution. Now, normally when I make bubble solutions, I use glycerin. But I don't have any glycerin in my home right now. And um, like most families, we're limiting our trips to the grocery store. So instead, we are using honey. So what we have here is we have four cups of water, one cup of dish soap. I like Dawn best, but you really can use any dish soap. And then we have two thirds of a cup of honey. Now I put mine in this big container here, and that is so um, later people can just rip it out from the bottom so kiddos don't spill it, and there's less chance of that happening. So all you do is mix in your bubble into your bubble solution is your dish soap first. Then we mix in our honey. Now I brought a spatula here because it can be really sticky. And you wanna get all of that honey in. Now I've pre-measured mine for this quick video, but I really recommend um, that you have your kiddos help you with the measuring um, and the pouring. It's really great for their fine motor skills. And then all you're gonna do is mix it up. Now you don't wanna mix it up too much because you don't want all the bubbles to release. So you're gonna mix it up a little bit here and then you're gonna let it stand for about an hour. Uh, and then it's time to play. So what I really like to do is use that little spout on the bottom, put a little dippy cup underneath or another small non-breakable cup and keep them pour it out there themselves. Because I have to spill their bubbles like most kids do. They only spill a little bit at a time. 